Hey Collective, what's up? Welcome to my channel, Journey to Soul. My name is Z, what is up everybody? I'm doing a quick intuitive message here for the Collective All Signs included. We are in Virgo season. I hope all is swell. Please like, subscribe, and share if you like the message and it resonates here, okay? Cool. All right, let's tap right into the energy and see what is going on. Happy birthday to all my sexy, handsome Virgos. I hope you guys are enjoying your season. Archangel Michael is in the building here, okay? I'm seeing that card. So I got a download here um, about someone doing fraudulent insurance scams here, okay? It has a lot to do with car wrecks perhaps here, okay? Um. Now, I don't know if someone stages car wrecks. Um, this could be known and unknown people, okay? Uh, you know, regardless of whether the person in the car is aware, all right? But someone definitely does fraudulent insurance scams uh, when it comes to car insurance, car wrecks, things of that nature here, okay? That's how they get their money, all right? And somebody has some in-laws who have already taken someone out in the past here for some type of finances here. This could be life insurance, inheritance, will, and or estate here. They've already done this here, okay? Um, and think that they have gotten away with it here, okay? Um, and take what resonates, you know, take someone out. This could be a transition of a physical life, a physical vessel here. Or this could just be um, scrubbing someone's name out of the wheel, okay? you know snubbing somebody for their portion okay but we're gonna see what's going on okay someone sh shouldn't have came for you collective okay they were told they were warned multiple times to stop coming for you now there's so many skeletons falling out their closet here i feel like they cannot keep up here okay um so let's see i haven't pulled these cards out in a while i was told to go and get them here let's see what comes out Okay, 717, somebody's definitely tapped in, y'all please, at the top of the deck. In it for the money, the moolah. This is a lot here, okay? I'll take it. In it for the money. What's at the bottom of this deck, y'all please? Not the fans watching. <laughs> the fans are watching here. And then I have MacGyver here. So you're always getting out of something here, possibly even at the last minute here, Okay. Um, something about you being under pressure. Someone um, performs at their best when they're under pressure here, okay? Mm -hmm. So maybe, you know, whoever your adversaries are quote-unquote self-proclaimed enemies didn't know that about you here. Okay, there could be an uncle that's involved here, something about a fire, all right? Mm -hmm. These people are crazy as hell in 444. Spiritual awakening and growth, strength and foundation. There is another mass, like another round of mass awakenings going on. People who are just not getting on their journey. And those of you have that have been on your journey for a while, you guys are going to the next level. That's what I've been picking up here, okay? Yeah, these people are crazy as hell. Someone is not in their right mind. Something about somebody needing to look in the mirror here, okay? Hmm, interesting. Okay, so an uncle, use your intuition here about an uncle here. I don't know if there was a fire, okay? I don't know if someone wants to manufacture a, a fire here, okay? Here are fire and desire. So here are a human crisis here, child, what is this? Okay, so somebody could have had um, a come up when it came to some type of fraudulent insurance claims. I'm um, having to do with the fire, okay? Somebody could have started a fire themselves and filed an insurance claim, okay? Cool. All right, well, you know, let's tap into the energy here, okay? <laughs> mm -mm. Okay, could be a lot um, going down on social media here, okay? Could be a lot of conversation here. Something somebody said or did on the in the past here when it came to social media here. Yeah, somebody could have been messing with your platform, manipulating views and likes here, okay? Or trying to distort uh, people's view of you here, okay? Maybe someone was using their platform, their podium, their voice here to downplay you, downcast you here, okay? 
Uh, let's get a few of these and then get into the tarot here, okay? So I do feel like somebody here has set fire to something here in the past. They've, they've already done this, okay? And this doesn't have to be an in-laws. It could just be ex, okay? Your ex's family, okay? So in love at the top of the day. Interesting here. Unethical and just illegal and unlawful here. So be mindful of being um, blinded by love here, okay? Because in the background... Someone's doing something that's uh, unjust here, okay? Um, within a situation or possibly even towards you, okay? Child. Yeah, I mean, somebody could be coming forth here. You could be dealing with an earth sign. I was picking up on a Taurus, perhaps a masculine energy here, but you could be an, um, an earth sign here. And someone wants to come forth and act like they're so in love with you here, okay? Mm -hmm. This person could like to party a lot here, okay? Let's see if I can get something to actually come out. Child, they keep talking about retrograde and travel here, okay? Something about somebody traveling in the past, okay? Or take a moment to, I'm here, relax, think, and breathe before you travel here. Retrograde, slow down and revision how we want to go forward. No more flow of energy is reversed here, okay? Mm-hmm. So I feel like this is about taking a moment to pause here, okay? Mm-hmm. Travel. Mm hmm Maybe someone has a property or something at a distance here, okay? Hmm. All right, let's get into the tarot, okay? It's always about some damn fraud here, okay? Somebody's money-hungry ass, okay? <laughs> yeah, with the magician energy and the seven of pentacles. You know, with these readings, uh, all of these, these criminals, they're being watched here, okay? So I'm picking up on a lot of delusional energy energy here okay i'm hearing mindset people who are not in their right minds here they're they're pulling a lot of desperado moves here okay and i feel like for the most part the target is being protected here okay but you're dealing with people possibly maybe they have um high positions high ranking in the 3d or in the 5d here and there's a lot of arrogance okay Arrogance is what's going to put the nail in the coffin here for somebody's plots, plans, and schemes because arrogance is overruling the reality of a situation here. The reality is you're being watched, dumbass, okay? So, you know, I feel like someone has gotten away in the past with something here and they feel like they're going to do it again, okay? Fire, fire. Maybe your uncle could be a fire sign here, okay? Somebody could be from the islands. The magician with the king of pentacles here yeah you know king of pentacles representing a significant amount of money here somebody they want to do a lot of manipulation this is what they're doing here you could be dealing with the con man someone sits in the king of pentacles um status position this could be a business owner an entrepreneur here a ceo okay but um it's sketchy in regards to how they got their position okay yeah, somebody could have a chair or a seat here on some type of committee, okay? This person is the king of manipulation when it comes to finances here, you know? You could be dealing with an Aries. Um, I'm also getting, I'm hearing forerunner. Somebody um, sits as the king of pentacles out in the front to the public here, but they're being controlled, okay? Fire, these people are crazy. Somebody's dealing with an ascended master, 444 on the board here. Okay, somebody's putting numbers on the board here. Okay. <laughs> That's cute, spirit. Mm -hmm. What is that? Who is that? Oh, my God. I can't think of it. I can't think of the artist. Numbers on the board. I can't think of it. I'm hearing the song, but I cannot think of the artist. Damn. Put numbers on the board. Balling. I put child, something like that. Ace of Swords here. Yeah, this is the truth about this asshole. Okay? We are on Friday the 13th here. This is the truth about this person here. Okay? So you have a fake kingpin is what they're saying. Somebody's a fake kingpin. They got their, their dough, their finances, their prosperity here by running scams. Okay? Mm-hmm. Yeah, death card. Also, the truth about an ending here. Ooh. Somebody could be trying to manifest a death, okay? Or they could manipulate death, okay? Again, you know, fraudulent um, 
death records here. Again, when we're talking about life insurance, somebody tries to manually manufacture a death. Okay, whether this is an actual uh, physical passing of a person, a being, or just a situation here so that they can get money. Okay. So. Mm -mm. These people, they had to get the hell up out of here. Yeah. They could put try to put people under a lot of stress here with the Ten of Wands energy here. Okay. This could be someone who is into the occult. All right. They throw a lot of alchemy around here. Dark energy. Yeah, with the seven. Yeah, a whole lot of projection here with the Ten of Cups. Y'all, please. Somebody does a lot of death spells and shit. Okay? Mm, they try to put people in a flat line energy here. Okay? With the Ten of Swords. This is what they're projecting. This is what they're throwing out here. Okay? Mm. Mm -hmm. Somebody could be trying to put an end to an emperor energy here, all right? So let's see what's going on on the current timeline here because I feel like this is somebody's steal up, all right? This is the past, present, and the future. What's their next move, okay? Why is this person coming out here? Because they're still uh, plotting here. This person has the nerve to have an evil eye on somebody. Somebody's envious here. It could be dealing with the queen of wands here, okay? Somebody's scorn and envious here. They're lurking, okay, from behind the scenes, child. I'm over it. Okay. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. <laughs> what is wrong with people? What is wrong? Somebody's scary. Okay. Retrograde. Hmm. Okay. Six of Wands here with the Empress energy, child. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. So this is you collective, regardless of whether you're coming up, um, whether you are a masculine or a feminine energy, you got some type of victory, okay? Yeah, over a tragedy. Yeah, somebody could have tried to do this to you. They could have tried to manufacture some type of ending when it came to a car wreck here or a fire, okay? And this is how you're coming out. Six of wands with the Empress energy. Not only are you alive, well, and thriving, you know, this is triumph here, okay? So, mm-mm. Mm-mm, what's this? Somebody's trying to work something out in the background here. You could alchemize some energy here with the Eight of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck and the Two of Pentacles at the top of the deck. Yeah, confirmation here with the Two of Pentacles and the Eight of Wands here. Somebody could have set this towards you here, okay? Mm-mm. Child, what is this? Child, you alchemize something into uh, prosperity. Landing up right in your, landing right in your hands here, okay? Somebody could have paid somebody as well. There could be some conversation about an exchange of money, time, energy, and or resources here. Child, you got a queen of pentacles that is getting karma here, okay? So you got the victory over a queen of pentacles here. This person is receiving karma here, okay? So this was another feminine energy that was coming up against you here. Yeah, they were working in the dark here, okay? Since the past, this could be somebody from your past, somebody you grew up with here, somebody, you know, I'm just getting, um, like, since childhood here. This Six of Cups could represent your home, your hometown here, okay? Mm-hmm. Someone you've had a long standing and or rapport with here, okay? Mm-hmm. So this person is trapped in an old cycle here, okay? Like this person, they don't have any other ways of getting money here because they don't have any um, spiritual prosperity to manifest from here, okay? So someone, they have to scam, they have to scheme here, okay? Or they get to nothing, okay? This queen of pentacles. There's nothing positive that they can do to get money, okay? Because they have to pay back debts. Again, somebody has already did something heinous to someone for finances here. Okay, yeah, Ace of Cups. Child, somebody needs to sit the fuck down somewhere. Excuse my language here. Okay, because you got the victory with the Ace of Cups. This is divine. This is, your cup is overflowing here. All right, somebody threw the Seven of Cups at you here, child. And by the time it got to your side of town, wherever you're at, it turned into the Ace of Cups for you here. You alchemized the shit out of something here. Okay, child, somebody is getting schooled. Okay, child. Mm -mm, about to get the hell up out of here. Mm-hmm. Mm-mm. Somebody. 
I don't know if they know you or what's going on here. Yeah, with the moon card, okay? What What is this? Yeah, it went into the unknown or something. Like, <laughs> child, somebody could use the moon to try to manifest something dark in your life. That's not working. Could be dealing with the Pisces here, all right? Mm -hmm. Child, uh -uh. somebody threw the seven of cups with the, with the, um, the death card at you. You came up with the Six of Wands and the Ace of Cups here. Last spread, okay? You know, uh-uh. So this could be energetic. This could be all alchemy. Maybe somebody is using the element of fire, candle work here. Okay, rituals here to try to manifest something in your life here. And you're ending up with an, a, an upgrade here. You could be seeing 717 on the clock here, okay? On a license plate, on a sign here. All right, chariot. Mm-hmm. Yeah, confirmation with somebody being watched as well. Mm -hmm. Oh, hell no. Somebody wants to come towards you here, you know, with an apology or some type of childish ass offer here. You know, I'm hearing um, extend an invite here. No, somebody tried to take you out here, okay? Mm -hmm. With the eight of wands here. Somebody possibly wants to communicate. They want to travel, okay? You could be traveling. Let's see what this is. I thought I was done. But you got spirit saying somebody still wants to come towards you like you boo-boo the fool. Like you don't know what they had going on in the background here. Okay? It could be this queen of pentacles here that's desperate with the temperance energy here. Mm-mm. Uh-uh. Your four of cups energy. No. No. You're saying no. Um, you have angelic protection here. Oh, yeah. With the high priestess, somebody was dealing with the divine feminine. Somebody was also dealing with someone who is higher ranked than them. That This is why, this is how you're able to alchemize um, this death energy that's being projected. Okay. I feel like repeatedly here. Okay. So it's like somebody's throwing you nuggets and you're turning them into gold. Okay. Temperance energy with the high priestess. Uh-uh. Somebody needs to take a, a seat in the back of the class here. Okay. Get out your notepad, your pencil, your pen here, all right? You know, don't speak until you're spoken to. If you have something to say, put your hand up here, okay? Mm-hmm. Yeah, because you got grounded here, all right? Uh-huh, with the Four of Cups energy and the Queen of Pentacles, it's a no. It's a no. You could be the, uh, the new Queen of Pentacles here, okay? Or the old, all right? Yeah, your money is protected here, okay? Okay. Let's close this out. Mm -hmm. Can somebody know? They should... mm -mm. No. Somebody could be blaming people or, you know. There's going to be an energy here where their finances or their resources get gets low. They start blaming everybody else. Somebody needs to look in the mirror at their own crazy self here. Yeah, change. Okay? Whew, Anubis is here. All right? Mm-hmm. Interesting. Number 89. Maybe somebody was born in 89. Somebody was born in 98. But what's, what's going on? Okay. So there could be an ending here. Okay. It could be this person's ending. Somebody wanted you out of there so bad. Okay. They wanted to make a dollar off of your ending here. All right. Mm -hmm. And you know, that's balance. That's justice. That's fairness here. Okay. You know, if somebody's going out of their way to put an ending to you, your finances, your stability here, your life, your health, okay, your livelihood. When the energy balances out, there's still going to be a change, but it's not on your end here. Okay, somebody's also being judged, okay? All right. The, the book is open on them here, okay? All their deeds here. This was a risky gamble, okay? And they thought about it here, you know? Mm-hmm. So this is someone who is truly uh, diabolical and evil. This this message is not going to be for everyone here, okay? Like, if you know, you know. If you know you're dealing with a lot of evil people, evil family members, evil ex-lovers, evil ex-friends, a community here, then you know exactly what this is about here, okay? Mm -hmm. All right, let's try to make this the last spread here. There's going to be a change. There's going to be an ending, just not yours, okay? Mm -hmm. Or what happened is somebody threw so much death magic at you, you went through a transformation here, okay? A snake, yeah. It's going to be an ending to a snake here, okay? Mm-hmm. Yeah. 
This could be somebody's lover here or somebody you had a soulmate connection with in the past. Okay. One more spread. I'm snake. Somebody was dealing with snake. A, a bed of snake, or, you know, a pit of snakes. You know. Mm-mm-mm. Because it took someone out in the past. This card fell to the floor here. Child, this is somebody's lover. This queen of pentacles here could be a queen of pentacles that wants to take out a lover here. This card fell on the floor here, okay? And I just feel like somebody's time is up. Again, um, I'm hearing as they perceive, they perceive themselves to have gotten away with this already. So someone feels like a master here. Like they'll, I'll just do it again, okay? Um, and when it falling to the floor, this energy Again, if this is energetic, spiritual text, that energy has already been grounded here. But this is a dead plan, okay? Somebody is not going to get another come up here when it comes to scheming on other people's lives. They can hang it up. And the effed up part about it is this person cannot, like somebody can, even if they turn a leaf right now in today and they decide to um, fly straight on the upright, they still have karmic debt to pay. Possibly for the next few lifetimes here. Okay? So. All right, collective. That has been a reading. Thanks for watching my channel, Journey to Soul. Bye.